Candle makers don't want you to know that. You will never need to buy a single candle at the market again after this tip. That's right, folks. In addition to never having to buy a candle again, this will leave your home super fragrant. So first, get a glass container or canning jar. Okay, I'm using this one. But you can use any container as long as it's glass. So first, we're going to need some coarse salt. Go ahead and add a thick layer of about two fingers. Let me put it here. Check it out, folks. Just like this. All right, this is going to be our foundation, okay? Now let's go ahead and add some lime slices. I'm using one whole lime for this, as you can see. Go ahead and place them in. And now we need water. Add water until the lime is covered, leaving a space of about two fingers as well. Now I'm going to put some cloves too. I like it because it's very good for scaring away insects and it has a pleasant aroma. I'll just go ahead and add a handful of them here. I'm also going to add cinnamon sticks here, which also have a very pleasant spell. And I'm going to finish adding some eucalyptus essence, just a little. And folks, feel free to replace any or all of these ingredients. If you want to put rose petals, sunflower, orange peels instead, go ahead and do it. Get creative, because here you're giving the aroma to your lamp so you can customize it. And now we're going to complete with some fill for our lamp. In this case, we're using vegetable oil. You can use any type of oil for this, including use it cooking oil. So just go ahead and top up with oil. And as everybody already knows, water and oil don't mix. So the oil is not going to mix with the water. And we'll stay on top. And this is going to be the... And now for the next step, you need a little piece of plastic. And for this, I cut out the bottom of a plastic cup. If you have those glass bottle caps, you can also use them instead. And we're going to also need a piece of string. This will be our wick. And here's what you're going to do. Bend the string like this. Make a small hole in the plastic and then pass the string through the hole and here at the bottom, leave a point on each side like this. Now just go ahead and place a wig carefully in this position. All right, folks, let's go ahead and light it up. And here's the thing. Why do I call it infinite? Because the water we added will always remain in the container. What will end up here is always the oil. So when you notice the volume of oil reducing here, just go ahead and add some more. And buddies, that's why this is our infinite candle. This amount of oil we added here will keep you lit for almost one whole day. In addition to leaving a very pleasant smell, of course. So it's very nice. So that's it, folks. When the lights go out, no more candles. Try this instead in your house. In addition to leaving a very fragrant, it will scare away any insects because of the cloves. And it also makes a very nice decoration item.